to a story you'll only see on local 10 news a Fort Lauderdale homeowner starting the new year with an unexpected and very expensive water bill. We're talking about $8,000 and when she couldn't get answers from the city, she called us for help. Christian De La Rosa has the exclusive. 70 something Rosemary grieves. I'm here 50 years, but this new year hasn't been a very happy one for her. I cried all morning. You would cry too if this happened to you. A city of Fort Lauderdale water bill for over $8,000. I couldn't sleep at all last night. I'm just a nervous wreck. Her water bills are usually way less. Normally $88. Her utility billing nightmare started late last year. December, $6,930. Miss Grief says she called to complain and personally went to the city's utility department. And they said, okay, we'll investigate it. I said, how long does that take? Three months. She was asked to hire a sprinkler company to check for leaks. Nothing. And the city sent someone to check her meter. Nothing. What she did get from nothing. the city was a late fee. Penalties, 6282. The longtime city of Fort Lauderdale resident called Local 10 News after calling the city yet again Wednesday and speaking to a department supervisor. He said, call a leak detection company. Hmm. What do you what do you make of all this? Oh, what do I make of this? I just don't want no other widowed woman to go through something like this because it, it affects your health. So like they say, I guess third time's a charm. Thursday morning, a third technician came to Miss Greaves home and found a leak underground. But what about her water bill? The city tells us she won't be on the hook for it. A city spokeswoman telling us in part, luckily this customer was able to get a professional to identify the source of the leak. In this case, we were able to credit the majority of the amount with leak adjustment credit available to customers in this situation. Our goal is always to provide the best service to our residents and use every avenue possible to find a solution. What do you make of all this? I know, thanks to you. No, really? no. Oh, yes, yes. You calm my nerves. My anxiety made it just like... I didn't know how to handle anything. We just hope Miss Grieve can finally get a good night's sleep. By the way, the city's spokeswoman also added that if any customer notices an unusually high bill, to reach out to the city's utility department right away and request an investigation to get to the bottom of the issue. Reporting in Fort Lauderdale, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10.